can't we just get out of here? Yo yo, boys and girls, it's your boy Diverse here, back with another video for the channel. I hope you're all having a great day, wherever you are, wherever you're watching this video from, I hope you're having a smashing day, wherever you are. You know how it goes, boys and girls. Saturday is here, the one day of the week people look forward to, especially me, for obvious reasons. Southern in action today, away to Wealdstone. Let's get into this. But before we get too far into this video. I have to start by saying thank you to everyone who voted for me in the Football Content Awards voting scene because I am happy to say we have made the finalist group. It is stupid to be saying that. I'm still not over and it's not clogged up in my brain here that we are actually going to be going up to Manchester in a couple of weeks time to potentially be winning an award. But there's one catch. If you think I am worthy of being the best in non-league as a vlogger, then head down to the description Hit the link, go down to Best in Ollie, you'll find a drop down box of me and about four or five other YouTubers, vloggers. There are some big names in there, some tough opposition, but I feel we can do it again. We've done it once, let's do it again. I love all your support, let's keep this going. But into the game we go today, Southend versus Wheelstone away. This is a first for me as well, I've never done Wheelstone, I've never been to a Wheelstone game, so it's a first for me, but... From what's been described by Kevin Mayer, Wheelstone like to get the ball on the floor and play it quick and spread the defender, spread the midfield and cut in through the middle, which it works. It really does work. It's a typical sort of thing, but I feel we could have them today. You know, they're in six with 16 points, so it's an impressive start. We can't overlook that. But I feel if we play the way we did against Wrexham, which we were so unlucky not to get a three points from that, they did not want it. We did. It's just a typical game of we wanted it more and we didn't get it. But I think the same squad's going to be put out versus Wrexham. Still no Steve Arnold. There's rumour of a keeper coming in on loan. It might be announced today, maybe over the weekend. But, hey, let's see what happens. I've got to head down to Wheelstone now. A bit of a drive for me. But let's get in there. Come on, you boys. Get the three points. <laughs> Coming in, all this is just worrying. Big chance here for Blue, he's got to convert. There's too many chances, not gone in. Alright, half time it is then. 
right in the north, half time here in Wheelstone, nil nil, it's bloody windy, I don't know if my camera's picking any of this sound up, but we'll give it a go. A lot of huff and puff and blues, a lot of trying and a lot of missing unfortunately, it needs to be settling in the back of that net sooner or later, or Wheelstone are going to score and nick it at this rate, you know what? Hyde missing, Mooney missing, we're trying, we're honestly looking like we could score but it needs to settle in, once a goal goes in the players will relax and we might even go and get more. Will stay on the counter look dangerous, their defence is nice and tight keeping us closed down. We need a breakthrough, we need a stroke of luck to go our way, maybe the ball bounces the wrong way for them and we nick it and score but I was so open we'd score in front of these away fans, the atmosphere would have jumped but you know what, big second half. Penno, who takes it? Oh dear. is on this, the young, big striker. Put it in. Set in the wrong way, 1-0.
right then all back well i shouldn't say back at home now should i because i'm not at home because you might realize this is a bit of a different background a bit of a different vibe no so my pc at home is currently in repair status it gave up last week after the vlog and it's not been in action ever since i'm currently at my old man's house editing this video the commitment levels for these vlogs at the minute are through the roof i'm just going to say that but full time one nil the blues it's a couple hours off now so i've had time to talk with my old man think over there and to be fair we could have won by so many more. Wildstone looked threatening. There was times, even towards the end again, they were throwing the ball in the box, but it was just not falling their way. And thank God it wasn't to be fair. Otherwise, I think a lot of Blue fans would have been annoyed. But we needed that three points today really badly. Hopefully, this kickstarts a good run. I know it's Yeovil next Saturday, which I'll be at. And then also that week's my birthday. And I think it's versus Woking as well on my actual birthday, which I will be there for. But... Do you know what? I'm just happy we got the points. I don't care how, I don't care why. We got we got three points against a team who was in the top seven prior to this game starting. I'm happy. We'll take it. On to bigger, better things. Hopefully Marcus Dacas extends his loan period. I know it's up, I think, at the 1st of October or the beginning of October anyway. So I hope he extends. You know, give him till January maybe. He's shown himself he's a big unit. He's mobile and he scored a bloody goal today. Two goals in three games from him. But anyway, all... I'm going to wrap this video up here. I hope you've all had a smashing day, watched the vlog, and thank you to all of you who came over and spoke to me during the vid, during the vlog, during the course of the day, you know. There were some people who asked for photos, some who just wanted to chat, some who wanted to be in the vlog, you know. I love you guys. You're the reason this channel continues to grow and get bigger, and it's the reason why we are going to Manchester. If we can win it, it will be a whole new level. But that's your choice, guys. If I'm worthy of your vote, be voting down below. My name's been Diversity. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.